<laughs> yeah. So we have a tiller as well. Very simple. Huge amounts of storage in the lockers. We have a well, we have a small fuel tank at the bottom of the locker, but that's not taking up much space. It's a very small one, actually. This is the new. This is new. All right. Oh yes. I oh, know. This is yes. I was interested in this because you said you managed to get a, yes, a kind was, of discount one. Well, this was two hundred twenty pounds. That's pretty good. With going. a regulator. Yeah. It's quite big. It's, I don't know. It's uh, you can get smaller ones like the Rutland uh, five hundred. Five hundred. Yeah. Which seems more appropriate uh, because. This is you can, just because of the blade size, you have to put it quite high up. Mm -hmm. And you said it wasn't really turning in light wind very well. No, it has quite a high startup speed, you know, maybe yeah. touching 10 knots. Okay. Uh, but once it gets going, it generates a lot. Ah, interesting. It can generate a lot of power. Right. So here is our wind vane self steering system. Hopefully, it's the most important yeah. part of the boat. What are these big vents for here? What's that fitting for? Oh, that's for a trailing rod. Ah. Have you got a trailing rod? Yeah, we. Oh, nice. Oh, that's really good. So it hooks into that plate. Then you chuck a rope with the. Yes. Yeah. 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 We need to be doing that tonight. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Quick polish, it's nearly done, look. Yeah. <laughs> well, actually. Well, what are you going to do with your woodwork? Nothing. Yeah. All right, let's have a look inside. I'll show you. Inside. Careful. Yeah. Careful with the step, it's not screwed in. It bubbles a little. Yeah, that's a lot of time. Yeah. Oh, this is nice. This that's is our four peak. peak. Yeah. We'll put together uh, our new structural bulkhead holding the inner four stay. Not much else here. Water tank is under the very forward part. Is there. So the heads used to be here actually facing sideways. Right. The heads used to be here facing sideways. Uh, now we moved it under the step here. Right, so this is uh, taking right. up virtually no space because the space, you know, there was some empty space below, uh, below this. That's a serious so, pump. That's really. Yeah. So this is our head pump, which yeah. also. Uh, you got a Y valve to the. We have a Y valve here, so you can switch it over mm -hmm. and use it to pump. And you build through the length of flexible right. horse here, so you can take it. Yeah, running. Yeah, that's really yeah. good. Roving right. bilge pump. And then, <laughs> and then, so this replaces. Uh, this is a lavac, right? So mm. you close the lid and you start pumping. You close the siphon valve, mm. the anti siphon valve on the seawater, which is like closing the flick switch yeah. on the. Uh, job score, yeah. except this is a chunky valve yeah. <laughs> so they put in, and then yeah. you have a chunky pump, yeah. and it all just disappears. It looks really good. Pump. Yeah, right. the, I mean, I like the I like the strength yeah. of that. Yeah, so this is all and the extra industrial. pump is a really useful it's thing. Very industrial. Uh, so yes, we'll have waterproof locker here. These ones with reverb storage. Uh, and just sitting on the head here, you have the headroom, you have good bracing, so it's much better than the tiny mm -hmm. cupboard here that used to be the heads really. Yeah, so here, all the bulkheads, everything has been glassed in and reinforced, that's all holding the shrouds up. Right, we haven't done, we haven't changed much here, we just took the headlining out and painted it all. Right. Uh, and then here we just put the chart table in um, two days ago and uh, the galley just came in today well the worktop so the chart table we have modified slightly Oops. so this is our new switch panel new led lights 
Uh, so the, the, fuse, the fuses used to be here under the step, and um, it was a system that has been extended over the years with switches everywhere, wires sticking out. So I put a nice switch panel, an instrument panel here. It all comes off with some uh, wing nuts. Big, big. <laughs> <laughs> it's big after yeah. But then you go in Kestrel, and you think this is. Yeah. You have a voltmeter here. Huge. Check this out. Yeah. This is the coolest part. Yeah, oh, that meter. Yeah, I wanted to get I that put, out I, I put a meter, I, yeah. I can send you a link. I put it yes. on Amazon. And then I put some test leads so yeah. you can, you know, you can wire up things and see. Yeah. Uh, I, hmm, you know, that's, uh, that's a light. Yeah. Uh, where do I put that? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do I want it here? Do I want it yeah. here? Yeah, no, that's and really nice. That's quite convenient. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, so we will have a, obviously a chart light here and then VHF, uh, SSB receiver. Uh, and there used to be some shelves here and the cupboard with sliding doors and we just, uh, well, uh, we had some discussions about it but in the end we decided to just put these soft pockets here. Those are pretty nice actually, yeah, yeah I like that. And then uh, here's our second bilge pump, which is here under the seat, mm. uh, also with a big tail. Yeah. Um, not much else here. I've raised the chart table, like I said, so now you have uh, extra storage. Yeah, you have about this much storage here mm -hmm. for full size folios. Before you could barely get one or two in. Mm -hmm. And then the galley is a cooker. The cooker is rebuilt from well, it's actually made from two cookers. <laughs> it's now <laughs> Frankenstein cooker. It's a Frankenstein, yeah. yes, yeah. Uh, but seems to work reasonably well. A new cross brace in front of the cooker, quite. Important, I guess. And is this a fridge? Going to be a fridge? No, it's, no, it's, it's just going to be a cupboard. Just a cupboard. It's, just a it's cupboard. not insulated. It's yeah. not. Uh, but it's relatively like it's a cold spot. Yes. Yeah. It's yeah. quite low, right? And it's away from yeah. things. So it stays relatively cold. So it's not. It's yeah. not cold in any way or insulated. Uh, and so that mysterious goes through. To yeah. Well, that's, that's, that's mysterious Ooh. indeed. That just goes straight through to the uh, yeah. to the cockpit locker. Right. Right. So there is a cockpit locker on each side. So I see. So that's open to the open to the outside. Yeah. Yes. Hmm. I might be a little worried about that. Why? Well, I guess you, you close you can close it. But... Well, I mean the cockpit locker lid is. Yeah. Uh, well, that's the, the outside. Yeah. I think outside. as long as you're aware that your cockpit locker lid on your starboard side is is also a, a gateway into the inside, then yeah. Well, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So we put a new gas line in. You know, yeah, from the gas lock all the way here. New gas valve. And what's under? So what's under the? Here, yeah, it's just this is more drawers. Storage, so just storage, drawers, drawers, drawers and storage. There's space, be, there's space behind the drawers. There's some drawers, some yeah. yeah. sliding doors. Yeah. And so where is the water tank again? Uh, in the bow. In the bow. That's right. Yeah. So I see. It's yeah. under the. Um, so we have a tap in the galley. All right, we have a freshwater tap and a seawater tap with foot pumps. Uh, the foot pumps right. There will be here. a tap. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm imagining it. So foot pumps are already working, but they only pump water into the bilge. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, yeah, and then we have another foot pump because of, uh, the water tank is only about 70, 80 litres. Mm -hmm. You know, so for longer passages, we have a lot of water in jerry cans. And then I put a foot pump just by the heads to pump water from a jerry can so there is a flexible uh, hose again. Yeah. So you drop it into the jerry can yeah. and pump it back into the tank. Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, That's good. Because, like I said, having water on tap is quite convenient for cooking and washing your hands mm. or whatever. Uh, rather, so rather than trying to pour water from a jerry can into into, into somewhere mm. something mm. else, or into, the, pump, yeah. into yeah. the water tank, mm. we have a pump. Yeah, mm -hmm. um, yeah, not much else here. So all the wiring is new. So these two conduits hidden there, they carry most of the wiring that goes forward. Ducts. Yeah, I'm a fan of ducts. <laughs> and. Uh, yeah. There is also there are also some that were molded in originally. They have the wires for the light forward. So there is one running along the top, which for the main cabin light. Can you turn that on? Engine. Uh, yeah. So the engine is down here. What sort of it's engine? A, it's a Volvo MG7B. Just a, mm. What is it? Two cylinder. Three is it two? Only two. Three. I don't. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> I haven't looked at it in a while. What power? Do you know what power? About fourteen horsepower. Mm -hmm.